Good morning, good evening, and good afternoon. Whichever time you are watching my channel, welcome. I am Reaper Renee 7, and let's get into this video. Y'all, please excuse me if I'm not looking directly at you. I am trying to adjust to myself using my iPad. So I'm trying to use that as well as use my phone. So today, I am talking about the items that I use for the winter season, what I used up, how far I've come. Some of the packaging is difficult for me to see through, so some of them may not be marked, but they do have a dent in them. So I did not mix a lot of my scents unless they only had one or the other, a moisturizer or a mist. So other than that, I was trying to enjoy the scents for what they are. What I have on today is the Amber and Argon and the Frosted Coconut Snowball. Now these, I hope I was smelling okay, but uh, I thought it would have been a good blend. The Amber, um, should be able to mix with some of the notes that's in here with the uh, Frosted Coconut Snowball. That's the Frosted Coconut Snow um, North Pole Vanilla Winter Freesia Snow Kissed Wood Spun Sugar. So the woods, I'm thinking, would have helped with this. So we shall see. Nobody complained. <laughs> Nobody complained. <laughs> so anyway... And I'm so proud of myself that I have used these items. And let's get into it. This is something that I did not touch except to put it on my tray. <laughs> my cart. I did not use this. I don't think at all. This was in, I think it was the lotion, was in my daughter's room. When I finally took it out to use it, I brought it in my room to use it. I still didn't touch it. So this right here, I was thinking about taking it back. But with the price being $15.50 and this $15.50, I don't know if there's anything that I don't have that will be in the store as low as this if I can get an even exchange. This is Twinkling Midnight Sky. So I may use this with my... Uh, well, I could just save it for next year. Um, Midnight Flower Sparkling Vanilla Iced Blackberry. So this to me is not a very sweet, but I think the vanilla that's in here helps give it a little sweetness, but I don't think that it is like just sugary sweet. But I just did not reach for this. So I do plan on using it. <laughs> unless I give it to someone, but yeah. I have the whipped vanilla chiffon and I may carry this over to my spring use it ups. And I really like this. This is a nice, sweet uh, to me fragrance vanilla. And I don't know if I'm going to say all the notes. I'm going to try to be quick, y'all. The notes are wild vanilla beans, sponge sugar, white peach blossom. And I do have a peach in here that I do not see the lotion. So I may use that with that and maybe get a nice, cute fragrance. The next, and I don't know, I'm trying to feel it, but it feel like it's like about here. So hopefully it will, is, is down there because I did try to use it. I didn't use this too much and this is the Triple Berry Martini. The notes are pomegranate juice, black raspberry, liquor, strawberry sugar. And I'm trying to read it because if you can see this, you can see that this is sort of difficult to even look at with me showing it to you. And this is the Triple Berry Martini. This is a nice scent. And I'm hoping to continue to use this. I may put it up and use it later on next fall. I mean, next winter or fall. But 
we shall see. The next one is, let me see, Joy. And this is Sugared Snickerdoodle. This is one of the gourmand scents that I wanted to try. I wasn't sure if it was for me. Um, I had asked my son to smell it. He said it smelled like butter, like popcorn. I don't want to smell like buttered popcorn. So, but when I smell it, I'm getting a different note. So I did mix this with vanilla. So another vanilla, which is the vanilla bean Noel with this. So I don't know if that was the cause of it smelling different. Because I don't get a buttery scent out of this. So, I don't know. The notes are snickerdoodle spice, creamy vanilla, sugared musk. So, I think it is a pleasant scent. I don't know if it's for me, though. So, I did get a good dent in here, if you can see. And then stop right here. And try to put my little hearts up there. Okay, and I didn't mark this one. So the next one is Vanilla Bean Noel. I was finally able to purchase this. And the notes are fresh vanilla bean, sugar, cookies, warm caramel, whipped cream, snow-kissed musk. And I like this scent. And I'm trying to use this up. I am so proud of myself. In the vanilla, you can see where it is. I did use this, but I was really trying to focus on using this up. So that's why this is down more than this. And yeah. Next one is Fireside Flurries. This one I think is a lovely scent. And this is Toasted Marshmallow, Pink Lavender, Cashmere Woods. Yes, I enjoyed this and did get complimented on this. And this is about here. And I can't see through this, so I couldn't, I'm sorry, I couldn't show you that. The next one is Sweet Whiskey. This is one of my favorite scents from Bath & Body Works. And you can see where this is. Look at there, look at there. I'm so proud of myself, look at that. That is so wonderful, y'all. And I hope you all are using up your fragrances. The next one is Peach. I'm sorry, Peace. This is Ice Raspberry Bellini. Lovely packaging. And I have Chilled Prosecco, Sparkling Raspberry, Citrus Twist. Yes, I can smell the citrus note and the raspberries. And that's how far I've gone with these. Oh, it's so fun, y'all, because when you use it up, something else can come in. <laughs> the next one is Pink Chiffon. That is Sparkling Pear, Jasmine Petals, Tierra Flower, Vanilla Orchid, Chiffon Musk. This is a nice, fun packaging, and you don't want to look too long because it may have you going all over the place. And I used this up to here. Didn't use this as much. And this one is to here. Tried to see if I could see through it in the lighting. So the next one is Champagne Apple and Honey. This one is Pink Lady Apple, Sparkling Champagne, Jasmine Honey, Autumn Woods. Now this was put into here because I wanted to carry this into my in my purse, but it is down pretty good. I didn't um, was I didn't mark this one either, and I was using this this raspberry black raspberry vanilla, and I am down here. I didn't really feel a need to do this because I'm trying to finish this. My daughter snatched up the uh, body mist because she wanted to use it for herself. And uh, yeah, this is pretty good, y'all. I really enjoyed this. And the notes here are fresh raspberries, vine ripened blackberries, vanilla orchid, creamy sandalwood, cashmere woods. 
Yes. See where it's at, right? Okay, this is fresh raspberries. This is by the um, Body Shop. Um, one of my first times using this, a product from the Body Shop. So this is what it looks like. And I did blend this in with other fragrances. I think it was this. I'm not sure, but I did use it with another fragrance. I did blend that because I don't have anything to go with this. And to me, the raspberry is not strong. So, yeah. And I had purchased this from Ross and it was $7.99. Okay, that is all for my fragrances that I had for the winter season. And I hope that you enjoyed it. And I had more than that, but I have my... Let me see if I can get y'all to see what I have down here. See that right there? That is what I'm going to try to show you later. And I had already put some of my notes up. So my body mist up. I had already put them up. So I'm going to leave those right there where they are. Thank you so much for watching my video. Hopefully it was something that you liked and that you are encouraged to use your products. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button. I am trying to reach my 500 subscribers before summer. Check you later. God bless.